Hi everyone, in front of me I've got Kodak K12 and let me show with you how to um, turn off ads and their personalization. So let's begin with opening the settings and uh, let's start with uh, tapping on network and internet which is at the very top of the list. Here let's tap on private DNS and tap on private DNS provider hostname. Here in this section where you can enter the name, the hostname, enter dns.adguard.com and tap on save. Thanks to adding this DNA, DNS guard, uh, dot com to your device, um, it will limit the um, the advertisements. Moreover, in this left section, scroll all the way down to find Google services and preferences. Then go to all services and here scroll to find ads. Here we've got something which is called advertising ID and basically I recommend uh, to uh, first of all reset it and then delete it. Uh, basically removing it will not limit the amount of advertisements which you get but um, it will limit the personalization because um, for example if you're looking for a specific item for example a table or you'd like to buy a lamp then your device will show you um, personalized advertisements with that kind of item or similar items with different offers so this is what we can limit by removing advert advertising id so as i said first of all tap on reset advertising id tap on confirm and then delete advertising id and tap on delete this is what we can do moreover we can also limit the notifications so if you are receiving a lot of advertisements in this notification panel we can remove or hide the notifications let's pretend i'm receiving a lot of them from Play Store. So tap on it and hold it and tap on App Info. Then let's go to Notifications and here scroll down. As you can see we've got plenty of uh, different categories of the notifications which we receive and what I highly recommend to do is to simply check um, or try to find any kind of notification that is uh, connected with the advertisement. So for example, in my case, payments, deals and recommendations. Simply tap on the switcher to turn off this category. Of course, if you do not need all of the notifications from the specific app, you can simply tap on the switcher right there to turn off all notifications. And as a last resort, I just wanted to remind you about ad blocks. And I know that it might be obvious for a lot of you, uh, but I just wanted to remind you about this option because nowadays we've got a lot of ad blocks not only connected with the um, browser, so for example the ad block for Google Chrome or ad block for, for, for uh, Firefox, but also the ad blocks for the content. So let's open the Play Store. Here let's tap on search and here tap on search and enter ad block or ad blocker or something like that and i just wanted to show you that we've got plenty of options to choose from uh, we've got of course the outlook for the browser but here we've got also for uh, the um, content blocker we've got an ad blocker for the whole android which is also nice um here uh, the ads blocker spam protection so highly recommend to check all of the apps which are available and um, and try to find the one which will suit you all right so that will be all thank you so much for watching please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up